as I said, setup wise is fine. You look pretty similar there in terms of the setup. Mm -hmm. Back swing wise, I say we look pretty similar there in terms of your back swing. Okay, so if we go right to the top there. That's where your club kind of stops. That's too much always. No, that's not. No, not at all. No, not at all. That's a good. I mean, for me, you got a good shoulder turn. Yeah. You got a nice wrist angle. Maybe more than 90 degrees, but that's okay. It's not collapsing the left arm. You're yeah. creating power with that movement. Okay, but what we'll see on this one here now as we go back. Okay is that sway it's there, your head's, your head's gone almost a whole head size yeah. across that line, so you're now <laughs> that far in front of the golf ball. Yeah. So you're going to be coming down mega steep into that golf ball unless you make some sort of adjustment which is up out of the shot. If we look at impact here now, how your head kind of looks a bit sort of looking round to the left kind of yeah, thing, yeah, yeah. whereas this one here now as we come back down, you can see your head's saying more stable. Just look at impact there, look at the peak That's of your better, cap. Yeah. Look at you there, and then yeah. your head's like, where's it going, kind of thing, because you sort of moved that way and then up and out the shot to try and adjust. And that's the thing, so if we can get yourself staying more over the ball with that, so we're on top of the golf ball more rather than yeah. over here somewhere, yeah. we've got a chance. Okay, your head, your lower half is going to rotate and slide and shift, or whatever you want to call it, and so on. There's going to be weight shift of the golf ball here now as you swing through, and your head will then come up this way, so you are going to finish on that left line there mm -hmm. behind the golf but ball, when you're to, uh, but exactly, then rather than then sort of then come back, you're kind of getting the same position there anyway, yeah. okay, you could argue the leg comes back a little bit there, that's probably a better finished position, yeah. but I think I'd rather you work in some ways staying a bit more behind the ball and allowing the, the arms to have room, mm. the need to flick will hopefully just start disappearing, that flick has become sort of something you've instinctively done to stop a ball basically shanking or slicing yeah, to the right, yeah, yeah. but your reasons you're doing that is because you've got on top of the golf ball as we said, way in front of it here, nowhere to go, clubs left wide open, handle the club rising up to try and get out of your own way, and then it's like, oh hang on, <laughs> and, you, and you're just saving it, and again, what you'll find is you'll come to driving range, and we see a lot of guys at 10, 15 golf balls in quite small space time, yeah. and then after 12 or 30, you, you find you a move. Those four there. wrongs or five wrongs make yeah. a right, and then you hit the ball 150. Oh, great, I've yeah. got it. And then you come back three years later, oh, what was that feeling yeah, again? Yeah. First yeah. tee yeah. shot, doing, second shot, oh, crap. and it takes you 18 holes, as you said, yeah. to find a good one, okay? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, the feeling feels, I say, top of the back swing, just feel like your, your lower half's doing the shifting, or your top half's hanging a bit more over the ball there rather than sliding. It will feel, as I said, a little bit got more room there through the golf ball. Oh, well, yeah, and your arms are spaced. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. When I'm doing that, I can feel it. My arms are stuck at Roman chest. Exactly. And it's like, where the, where the, the hell am I going to go? Yeah. They're all over here. yeah. yeah. And, and they're, they're, they're either stuck by the chest or they go away to try and find the room. Yeah. The shot you're going to lead to them is the unmentionable and then yeah. we get the old, the dreaded to case. So, uh, yeah, work on that transition down. Otherwise, the swing's looking pretty good, to be fair, mate. The, back, yeah. the top half is just doing this a bit too much yeah. and the arms and the body are trying to react to what this is doing. So the cure now is fix this rather than try and add some cures to, to compensate. Yeah, exactly. That's, that's an that. easier fix. Than oh, well, yeah, exactly. Yeah, and it's, it's, yeah. it's two wrongs. It's one. It's one change to fix the fault rather than three faults to try and cure a fault. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you, when you time it well, golf's easy, 44 point. But when you're not yeah. and you miss timing, it's like you want to give up the game of golf, don't you? So. Okay, that makes sense? Yeah, thank you. Good.